Dartfish is able to use video from many sources and video devices. Video already on your computer can be accessed from the library. And until you're ready to use keywords, use the folders view to browse your hard drive. To get new videos though, use the importer module. The devices listed here can be grouped into three types. And first we look at importing from those which create or contain video files on a disk or memory card, such as a camcorder or memory stick. Click the device in this list, or select the specific Copy Video to Library Importer from the Importer Buttons menu. You'll now be guided through several steps to import the video. First, you'll select the device you want to import from. Dartfish detects the file structure of certain camcorders and automatically displays the videos from them. But for other devices, you must browse for the folder which contains video files. In the next step, there is an opportunity to rename the files as they are copied. This is very useful when many camcorders give their video recordings meaningless names. Finally, the destination for the video files on your computer is chosen. After import, the videos appear in the library. And also shortcuts to those videos will appear in the tray, which gives you immediate access to the most recently used or imported files. Double click one of these to immediately review it in the player. Rather than importing files, many of you will be recording a live video stream, perhaps from one of these devices. Below the video area, I select my video source. In this case, a Logitech HD webcam. I enter a name for my recordings, choose where they'll be saved, then start to record. and click the same button again to finish recording. As before, the new files can immediately be found in the library. Finally, it's worth noting that certain Dartfish editions have other live import tools, such as for tagging, tag live mode, or when using in the action, which is the best tool for immediate analysis and feedback.